Twitter and talking and feeling really like uh, it makes things a lot better. Uh, I can, you know, bought a ton a lot of being on the phone and not even saying anything that we can, you know, have a conversation like that. Um, we've had that a couple of times. Um, you know, which I, again, I think shows that there's that connection between us. Um, a lot of things in common. Uh, you know, you have to say, I mean, we can help each other. I mean, I can help you with whatever. Um, but you have to let me in. Um, like you did before. Um, I don't know how this is better. You being alone. Um, and just kind of going through whatever. Uh, I can only imagine. I'm not really sure specifically. Uh, I know what's actually happening, but I can kind of imagine just in terms of what grief is. But, uh, I, mean, I think we can still help each other. Walk. Laugh maybe a little bit, um, you know, make that connection, uh, share each other's lives and ideas and fantasies, thoughts, and dreams, um, connect with each other, uh, like we've been doing, and continue with that, make that connection, um, and it's very special, I think, and I think we, I think you were thinking the same thing, that it was, you know, special, and, uh, we connected again at the same time, uh, at the right time, I should say, uh, you know, with me, with my problems, and that, um, and issues with parents, and kids, and jobs, and whatever, um, same as, you know, just, uh, and then, you know, if you don't, if you have that, that you found that kind of relationship that, um, you know, just throw it away, or you work hard to keep it, to, uh, continue, um, with it, and, you know, not to just toss it aside like it's, you know, garbage. Um, uh, I mean, like I said, I, I know you're going through things that I don't really understand. Um, I mean, I understand grief, but not uh, so much of a parent. So, I mean, I can only imagine. Um, but, you know, uh, you, you don't have to let me in to talk. But you don't even have to say anything, really. Um, on the phone, I mean, you know, I'm a good listener, um, I can not even say anything, just listen, um, like I said, I like to, you know, that I like to hear your voice, um, especially when you say my name, uh, I love that, you know, the things you sent me, that you say my name, um, that's very special. Uh, I'm like, you know, I think you're special, um, you know, with your mom, uh, her birthday, uh, I believe was around, like I mentioned, uh, I'm sure that was really hard for you, um, I don't know if you do anything, to commemorate, I guess, uh, but, uh, like I said, that, you know, makes you special, I think it would have been nice to know her, I guess, um, to a special lady, uh, just, I'm um, just trying to reach out, um, I would love to, uh, I don't know, call, you know, or even, like, a text for, obviously, um, things change, you know, maybe for the better, maybe for the worse, um, you know, but I think there's still, you know, could be, uh, something there, you know, connection. Um, I just don't know why you can just kind of toss things 
inside. I mean, I guess your anger, possibly your upset, your frustration, or whatever feeling you're feeling, I don't know, um, that uh, is making you feel this, um, you know, not being that reasonable with um, forgiveness, communication. People are human, and it takes um, and, um, you know, other people, I'm sure, in your life, uh, family and whatever people you talk to, um, friends, uh, make mistakes. So, obviously, you're not going to just you know, push them aside. Um, that's the first sign of any kind of trouble, you know, which doesn't make any sense. So it's, and you have nobody, really, because everybody makes mistakes. Um, but I think it makes you know, people healing, obviously, and they learn from those mistakes. Uh, and then do better the next time. And just the big thing, really, is really what we've been doing, being open with each other and honest, um, just sharing, you know, everything, good, bad, ugly, whatever. So this way there's really no surprises. Um, I mean, maybe there would be, I don't know, problem or something, but, you know, we should deal with it because you don't just toss it aside and, you know, put it under the rug, really, you know, because obviously it's still there. Um, I don't know, I just really think that there's something missing, you know, um, I just don't understand why you don't feel that. Uh, maybe you do. I don't know. Um, does it seem like you do? Just kind of pushing, uh, you know, pushing things to the side. Uh, I, uh, uh, I know, probably rambling, but I hope you can hear me. From my heart out, um, just you know, missing. It's like a part of me is missing. You know, my life, uh, I said it's you know pretty miserable um, without you. Um, you know, it's like a bright spot uh, in my life. You know, coming along at a very good time, best time really. And it was like a glow, it's the glow. Um, and helping me, you know, kind of cope with that. And like you said, just venting, you know, you are a good listener yourself. Um, you know, and also we do have uh, all those things in common. Um, it's a lot of the same things with personality and school and things with parents and sisters. And, um, a lot of the same interests. Uh, and just sort of being very quiet, kind of you know, keeping to ourselves, not really wanting to share, it's just having this very rare uh, thing, you know, between us. Um, we never, you know, had done that with anybody else. Um, and, you know, it's difficult to open up uh, and not, you know, be afraid to open up the things. Um, I just, I don't know, really, um, I get used, you know, you get used to that. Um, I would think you got used to it too. I'm uh, singing, joking, and you know, sending pictures and videos and you know, trying to get reaction for different things. Like you said, I make some work of certain things and you would send me um, intimate you know, pictures. Uh, that's the top and ass. Um, you know, making me feel better about that and making me feel better about maybe different things I looked too thrilled about within my body, and um, which was great. Um, and then so we're connecting on a different level. Like you said, um, you know, sharing each other's fantasies, thoughts, and stuff. 
intoxicating, um, you know, brings it to a whole other level. Um, so I can see that you, well, actually, you sent a few, but the one um, that really, you know, the first, I guess, the first one, um, the really long one that you sent, um, you know, that's like beyond, it wasn't just like physical, uh, you know, just, like connecting sort of like emotionally and psychologically and um, like almost like spiritually too. So connecting on, you know, several different levels with that. Um, I do love to look at those and all the, like I said, the pictures and the videos. Um, you know, the tree things. Um, you kind of kind of like, oh, I can get used to uh, doing that. Um, this person comes like, and I mean, you're still like talking to me and whatever. I'm not the thing that you're talking uh, to hear your voice and laughing and stuff. And hear the kind of moaning and the groaning in some of the other videos. Um, I, uh, they're, I really don't have, I guess it's my favorite. And I, I like, you know, I love them all, really. Um, and, you know, kind of play them as much as I can um, in between uh, teaching, you know, going to uh, St. John's and then having my job on Saturdays. Uh, so in between when I should be doing my work and whatever, um, I look at those and listen to those. Um, and like you said, you're with me, which is still true, um, wherever I go, um, in my thoughts and dreams, in the shower, um, on the phone, on the computer, um, like you said, in my blood, really, has become what's part of me. So I can't really shut that off, even if I wanted to. Um, and, you know, the distraction, but it's like a help, uh, like a healthy distraction, really. Um, which is great. I mean, like you said, it's not like, uh, you know, like a drug or drinking or something, but it kind of gives you that intoxicating feeling, you know, as if you were drunk. Um, that makes sense. Uh, so that you know, in there, um, and with me, you know, wherever you know, part of me. Um, and twelve oh three a.m. October fourteenth. End of final message.